Greetings from Steeltown, Ontario, where the champions and the challengers are set to lock horns in the Canadian Premier League as Forge FC prepare to do battle with Halifax Wanderers at Tim Hortons Field in Hamilton. Forge FC, four changes for Bobby Smirniotis from that 3-3 tie against York. In the back comes Dom Samuel. Malik Malewu will start at left back. Patrice Geiser makes uh, three changes to the 11. That beat Vancouver last time out, 3-0. In at the back comes Zach Fernandez at right back. Mo Omar is restored after fitness to uh, midfield. Shines to clear out his lines. And Gavin Kane's got room here. Campbell to his left. Poku to his right. Now, can they get the service right? Campbell's completely unmarked right now. Over his head, it'll come to Becker. And in the end, comfortable catch for Jan Filion. Samuel Poku makes his way in field at speed. Campbell ahead of him. Poku finds Campbell, now turning. The league's top scorer. He lost the face of goal, and Filion had to deal with that. Paddy Banger was right behind him. It'll come back for Kyle Becker. Timoteo's got some room on that far side. Decent looking ball forward, looking for Peruzza. I think there was a tug on the jersey. Peruzza's gone down. Referee says penalty. And there was definitely a tug on the shirt. And Mandrakar James, hands in the air, says it wasn't me. But there was definitely contact in the box. And Carly Shaw McLaren was in a good position, points to the penalty spot. Tristan Henry to put the Wanderers in front. Fine penalty. Straight down the middle. And Halifax Wanderers have the lead against the league champions. 4 0. Halifax Wanderers won. looking for that outlet on the right-hand side provided by Poku. He can hit them, Poku. Well, he can hit them. Nimic. Ferry. He can hit them from here if you give him room. Does hit one. Henry yelling at his defenders, Dominic Samuel, the subject of his ire. like he's playing in a holding midfield role alongside the advancing thinking about it took the shot on but couldn't keep it down Rajabapur is off the forge more importantly more defending to be done Three of their last four contests. Looking to hold firm again. Callum Watson. Up against Tom Samuel. Watson's done well. Infield it goes. And Rampersard needed a touch behind. Might whip this in left footed. Kyle Becker, free header clear. And then returned with interest and took a deflection on the way in another corner. Maybe that's just subterfuge, you never quite know. I expect him to try to hit it like a knuckleball now. Get it swerving. Paddy Banga does hit it! What a goal! Paddy Banga! Pulls full travel. Villiard never saw it. And by the time he did, it was Nestle in the back of the net. And with 11 minutes to go, Benny Paddy Banga. A banger for the Hammers. It's 1 1 in Hamilton. Strike that was. You don't hit it any cleaner than this. Look how it gets up and just dip it. It's nice when you have ball boys in that name, they can go get the ball. <laughs> exactly. Back up. Borges first time. A turning. Back. It's James. Nimic. No hurry. Watson, 
Maybe Watson this time. Watson! Wasn't quite elementary, but it wasn't far wide. Rama Borges. Three white shirts, still gets his pass away into the area. Helped away by Lockery. Rama, Becker, Borges! Corner. Four minutes of stoppage time. Don't take your eyes off this one. Wanderers fullback lining up to swing this in left footed. Rush hour in the penalty area. And to the tier, find a white jersey, maybe just wide. Just wide. And it was Nimic again, I think. Samuel yeah. looking to throw it in now. Last chance. It's done. Carly Shawbatarin points towards the centre circle. And the game is over in Hamilton. And for the third time this season, Halifax Wanderers have frustrated Forge FC, the champions.